Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today in this video, it's gonna be like a little series of multiple different hauls in this video. So the first haul is gonna be everything that I got from a store called Daiso. The best way I could describe that store is like a Korean Target dollar spot, like high quality things for super cheap, you guys, so cheap. Um, if you don't know, the Korean money currency is won. So for instance, 1,000 won equals to be about less than a dollar, US dollar. So for instance, something that's 10,000 won would be about, right now it's like 950 US dollars. So if that makes sense, and if you're not like understanding the way I'm describing it, you can Google it. But um, yeah, I got a lot of stuff today, super cheap. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys that haul. It's just like a some things we needed for the house. Um, also in this video, it's gonna be two grocery hauls. The first grocery haul is gonna be one that my husband did for me. I was super sick, not sick that day, I had a really bad migraine and he did the haul for me. It was like the first few little groceries we got for our house. And then um, there's gonna be another grocery haul, like a bigger grocery haul after that one. So if you are interested in seeing what we got from the commissary, that's the grocery part, and Daiso, then just keep on watching. The first couple things that I got were a couple of trash cans for our bathroom. I grabbed this one, I really like it, super neutral colors. If I'm looking past here a little bit, I just wanna make sure that I'm still recording. Um, and then I also got this one. I don't know if this one's gonna go in our bathroom or the kids' bathroom, but this one was, where's the price tag on this one? This one was 3,001, so that's probably about like less than three dollars us dollars so i grabbed a couple of those super cheap and you can see like how good quality these are they're not like super flimsy or anything like that the next thing that i got was a lavender oil diffuser this was three thousand ones like i said less than three dollars it's a lavender scent i got one of these to go into the bathroom and you can smell it through the packaging so i know it's gonna smell really good also i got these little trash can scent deodorizer things you put them on like the lid of your trash can this was only a thousand won so this equals to be about 80 cents us dollar so super cheap i got the lemon scent and um hopefully these work really well i also grabbed a mug look how cute this mug is it's pink and it's just super like simple and cute this was only two thousand won so this was less than two dollars us dollar so like i said super cheap you guys that store is gonna be a problem for me i already know like that store is going to be a problem because they have the cutest stuff in there. So I grabbed a cute little mug. Not that I need it anymore. Um, I also grabbed a few little face masks. I grabbed this one. It's all in Korean, as you can see. I can't read any of that. This one, it does say oh, vitalizing care, vitamin C. So I could see that right there, but it's all in korean in the back if you can tell like i can't read any of that but i'm gonna try i love a face mask who doesn't love a good face mask these are sheet masks though and then i also got a kiwi one yeah it's all in korean but these were only 500 won you guys so this was less than what about maybe 40 cents maybe i don't know it's just less than a dollar so super cheap this one was 1000 won so less than a dollar very happy that i found those so the next few things that i got were some plates for the kids look how cute these plates are these are definitely giving me target dollar spot like don't these look like something from like target dollar spot they are so cute i got a light pink one i got three white ones that are like off white and these were 2001 so less than two dollars i also got this shape super good quality like not flimsy at all, really good plastic. I got these gray ones. I like the shape of these, these are really cute. I also grabbed a footstool. This is gonna go in the kids' um, bathroom for Eli to brush his teeth. He struggles with like reaching the counter. This was 5,000 won, so less than $5. And like, look at the quality of this. This would easily be about 10 bucks somewhere else or more. Super good quality, cute, sleek shape. And it's so cute, like it's just simple and so cheap. Like. It's crazy to me. So going into the bag, I got a few more things. I grabbed some ice trays. I have some more in here too. I'll find those in a minute. But I got these type of ice trays. It's the slim ones that can fit inside a water bottle. These are going to be good for the kids' um, 
when they go to school and I fill their water bottles up in the morning, but I thought this was a really good deal. 1,001, so about maybe 80 cents for this. A really good deal. On Amazon, this could be easily, I don't know, I'll look on Amazon to see what compares, but probably more expensive. Um, also got me just a cheap little cutting board, super simple, like it's nothing to it. We have a lot of cutting boards with our household goods being shipped, but we still don't have our items yet. So I just want to get a few little, you know, cheap things to like tie us over until our shipment comes. But just a plain little cutting board. This was a thousand won, so less than a dollar. I also grabbed another one of these little uh, electrical whisk things for my coffee. I have one, it shipped, but I haven't had it in a while because our stuff has been gone for a while. 3,000 won, so less than $3. And hopefully it works good. I have some batteries, two AA batteries. So hopefully it works good. I'll give you guys an update on if that works, but I decided to grab another one because I needed one. The next thing I got were some white cups. These are just like plain white paper cups. I just feel like these would be really simple and easy for like the mornings for like the kids breakfast and stuff, just to have in the house for like a cup of coffee. I didn't really have a reason to get these, but these were 2,000 won. So less than $2 for 35 paper cups. Like that's a really good deal. So the next thing that I got was a, um, a sprayer, but this one isn't for the shower. This one is for the kitchen. It also comes with a water filter. I don't know if you know, but Korea has like really hard, harsh water. Like it's not really good water. So a lot of people have um, water filters for their shower and their sink, but this one is a kitchen water filter sprayer. Oh no, wait, this isn't a sprayer. This is just for the faucet. Oh, I thought this was a sprayer one. So we're going to see how this works. I don't know. I don't know why I thought this was like the sprayer nozzle kind. Mm, I don't know. We'll see about that one. I didn't really. It was but like it was less than five dollars only for something. So if it doesn't work, it's not going to be like the end of the world. I'm not going to be super upset about it, but I should have read it better. But yeah, that's for the kitchen sink one. I also grabbed another little diffuser. It's another little lavender one. This one will go maybe in another bathroom. It was less than a dollar, only 1,000 won. So I don't know I'm gonna put this, probably in one of the bathrooms. I also grabbed a spatula, super random, but we have one spatula, but I like to have multiple spatulas in the house. So I just grabbed this one. It has like the little wooden texture and just gray, super basic, 2,000 won. So less than $2. Also grab some more ice cube trays. These are like the smaller ones, but they're pink and like it's like half the size of the other ones. Super simple. I needed these less than a dollar, 1,001. The next thing that I got were these little wooden coasters. I just thought these were so cute. Like I really love the wooden look of these. They look like little plant leaves. And these were less than a dollar, you guys. These are so cute. So I love to have my coffee in the morning, so this would be perfect for when I'm having like my coffee in the living room. And the next thing that I got were some kitchen scissors. These are just like plain kitchen shears. I really need some. I use kitchen scissors a lot, and I haven't had any in a while, so I wanted to go ahead and grab these. Less than $3, so probably like two something, but can't go wrong with some kitchen scissors. And last but not least, I grabbed another little um, diffuser, less than a dollar. This one is... I don't know what scent this is, but it's cute because it has a little flower with it, so it'll be really pretty to have out. But that is everything that I got from Daiso today. I'm not sure my total. I'll probably put it up on the screen. You guys, like I said, I feel like the store is going to be a problem because they have the cutest stuff. And I was with, I was shopping with a friend, and if I was just by myself alone and I could really like browse, y'all, I probably would have went way more crazy in there because they had so much stuff. It's like. Like I said, the best way to describe it is like a Target dollar spot, but Korean stuff, you guys. They have beauty products, cosmetics. Um, they had kids stuff upstairs, but I didn't really get to go upstairs for too long because we had to go. But just look forward to more Daiso haul. But yeah, so the next part of this video is going to be the grocery haul my husband did. And then after that, you're going to see like the bigger grocery haul because we have to do another grocery trip probably tomorrow. So I don't know when this video will be up, but if you're interested in the grocery hauls, then just keep on First thing we got, we got some Cinnamon Toast Crunch, the generic Cinnamon Toast Crunch, and the generic Crunch Berries. The kids like to eat these for breakfast and things like that. Uh, we also got some almond milk, two things of almond milk for the kids that you'll use for breakfast and things like that. We got some grapes, um, got some blueberry, strawberry mix, oatmeal, the kids eat that for breakfast for school. 
And this is some coffee. Uh, I guess it's like kind of like a Starbucks brand, but obviously it's in Korean, so I can't really read what it is. But I got that for the wifey because she drinks coffee a lot. And I also got her some creamer, which is hard to come by here in Korea. So they can put a limit to only you only can get two at a time. So we got, I got that for the wifey. I got some Lunchables for Eli. These are the ones that he liked. So I got these for Eli. Um, I got some more of these ones that I like. So I'll eat these. Then I got uh, Madeline and Junior these Lunchables because they like the pizza kind of like. I got some Velveeta, got some rich peanut butter crackers, and got some uh, strawberry part tarts. For me, that's the best flavor. Some more snack food, some Oreos, Nutter Butter, and Chips Ahoy. Got two of these. Got some cheese. Obviously, I got the turkey, two of these turkeys for, for lunch. I have, I got some rice. It's an American brand, but I still, I never heard of this uh, ever in my life. But hopefully it's good. I got some uh, distilled vinegar for for the fruit, so we can clean the fruits off. Soak them in uh, some vinegar for a little bit. The apples and the grapes that I um, that I bought. Since we just get here, we don't have any seasoning, so I just got grabbed a couple of things of seasoning. Some barbecue sauce, some strawberry jelly. I got some Peter Pan honey roasted peanut butter. Got some Miracle Whip, some beef ramen, Korean ramen. I don't know what the flavor is. I'm pretty sure this is probably beef, but I, I have no idea what the flavor is. And this as well, Korean ramen. I'm pretty sure this is chicken flavored, but as you know, I can't read nothing that's on this, on this label. Since like I said, we just getting here, I got some silverware. Plastic words until we go out and get some actual silverware and stuff like that. Some paper towels, some toilet paper, some chicken, some chicken uh, tenderloins. Just use this for eat this for dinner. Some chicken breast. I also eat this for dinner as well. Might take some for lunch. And then some chicken thighs that I'll eat for dinner and then I'll take some for lunch. Got some apples. Got some apple sauce. For the kids, got some bread, Wonder Bread. Got the kids some chips that they can eat on for lunch or during snack time. Got two things of Minute Maid juice. And last but not least, got some Eggos waffles for breakfast. So pretty much this is our first grocery haul uh, here in Korea. The commissary that I did all by myself with no lists from the wifey at all. Um, if you want to see me do more videos, uh, BMW videos, do more grocery hauls uh, with the wife, things of that nature. Just uh, comment down below. Uh, also like and subscribe to my wife's page. Hey guys, so welcome back to the last part of the grocery haul, you guys. We got so much stuff. As you all know, when you move into a new place, you have to like restock everything. And like when I say we restocked, Look at all this, it's a lot. So let's go ahead and jump into it. Well, starting over here in the produce, I grabbed some cucumbers, green peppers, tomatoes, red apples, um, what are these? Uh, red peppers, lemon, cilantro, purple onions, and then some uh, purple grapes. Over here, we grabbed some uh, coffee concentrate. I didn't know if they were gonna have this. Um, iced coffee is very hard to find here in the commissary. So I saw this in the, um, like the, not the creamer aisle, where did I see this at? Like the tea aisle, it's a cold brew concentrate and um, I just wanted to grab this in case they didn't have that. So we'll see how that is. But they did wind up having the um, iced coffee that I like. This is the black one. I didn't like the hazelnut one my husband got me. That one, I just was not a fan of that one. So we're gonna see how the black coffee is for my iced coffee. Um, he grabbed himself these beef patties. These are really good, but um, he grabbed those for himself. We grabbed some dino nuggets for the kids. We grabbed bacon, we got corn dogs, red robin uh, steak fries. We also grabbed some um, the Alexia golden potato fries. Uh, we grabbed some pretzel thins. We got two boxes of this mac and cheese. We'll see how that is. Um, we grabbed some suddenly pasta salad. I got this for myself for like a quick and easy meal for lunch. Um, just add like some tuna and maybe some boiled eggs to it and it's like a you know a high protein lunch over here We got two containers of the mandarin oranges for the kids. We grabbed some strawberry applesauce. We grabbed eggs Over here. We have some frozen shrimp 
Um, over here, I got my favorite smart food popcorn. Oops. And then I grabbed some uh, pancake mix. Here is like the seasonings and like canned stuff. And so we're starting over. So we had to like restock on all of our um, seasonings and stuff. So over here, I grabbed some black pepper, some body of complete seasoning, sea salt, crushed red pepper, garlic powder, uh, nature seasoning, onion powder, cinnamon. We have some basil. We grab soy, uh, soy sauce, soy sauce, um, olive oil, Worcestershire sauce. We grabbed some teriyaki marinade, Caesar dressing, apple cider vinegar. We have some syrup over here. And then also I grabbed some bay leaves. I like to cook with that a lot. We grabbed some manwich for sloppy joes, some green beans, canned corn, um, Miracle Whip right here. And then we grab some tomato paste. And I also grab my favorite, uh, what is this, sweet chili sauce. I use this on so much stuff. If you have not tried this on some wings, definitely give that a try. Coming back over here, we grab some cheeses. We grab some fruit roll-ups. Junior wanted Gushers, but they didn't have any, so we just got those instead. Um, we grab some cinnamon honey grams. And then we grab some orange juice. I don't know if I said oil or not. But we grab these little Hello Kitty rice cake things. I don't know what these are. But I just figured Madeline would like to try them because she loves Hello Kitty. So I don't know how that is. We're going to see what that tastes like. We grabbed two boxes of the high C uh, juice for the kids. We got some chips, the fruit and cream oatmeal. The kids love that kind. We grabbed some oatmeal, oatmeal, <laughs> almond milk. We grabbed some bread. We have two loaves of like sandwich bread. And then we grabbed the kids their favorite um, raisin cinnamon bread. We grabbed... A pack of the Ritz cheese crackers, two boxes of the mac and cheese. I'm trying to go through this super quick because it's a lot of stuff, sorry. Um, we also grabbed some Jiffy cornbread mix, um, some flour tortillas. I wanted uh, corn, but they didn't have any, so these are going to be for tacos. We grabbed two bags of the Hawaiian buns for the uh, Sloppy Joes. We grabbed some shredded cheese over here. We got sliced cheese over here for the sandwiches. We got two packs of the sandwich meat. And then over here, we got some meats. We have ground beef, um, chicken breast. We have chicken wingettes. They're like halved. I don't know. We'll see how those are. And then under here, we grabbed some flank steak. That's going to be for the tacos. Over here, we grabbed a whole chicken. There was no brand on it, so I guess it's like the fresh kind. So we'll see. Um, over here, we grabbed some mild Italian sausage. That's going to be for, um, I'm going to make Zupa Toscana soup. And then we grabbed some half and half and some heavy whipping cream for my coffee. We grabbed two bags of the um, crunch berry cereal. And then this smells so good. It's the rotisserie chicken. So I wanted to go ahead and grab that for lunch, maybe. Coming over here, like I said, y'all, I'm going really fast because I got to put the groceries away. But I just wanted to show you guys what we got. So over here, we grabbed some um, fabric softener sheets. We got this scent. We grabbed some sandwich bags. Well, we grabbed some Febreze plugins. They didn't have a lot of selections, which I'm kind of sad about. And they were overpriced. These were like, for one, it was like $5 for just this one. It was way overpriced. So I'm going to check and see if um, Amazon, for like some seasonings that they didn't have, they didn't have a really big selection of those either. So I'm going to check on Amazon for some other things. Um, we grabbed one of these for the bathrooms. You guys know this is what I use to clean the bathrooms. Um, we got some sponges. We got some Downy Unstoppables. We got this scent. We needed some more trash bags, laundry detergent. We got the Tide Simply Fresh and Clean. We needed some more dishwasher tablets. We needed to re-up on all of our hand soap. So I grabbed some antibacterial ones. This one's for my sink in my bathroom. And just some more. And then over here, we grabbed a few vitamins. We got some kids fiber vitamins and some kids uh, the probiotics. Also grabbed myself some Benefiber because I'm definitely not getting enough fiber. We grabbed some uh, fabric softener. We got this one, the snuggle one. Oh, it says non-concentrate. What does that mean? I don't know. We'll see. Um, we grabbed some face masks, like the reusable ones that we just wash. Over here, we grabbed some face. Well, I grabbed these. These were like 50 cents a piece, but I love a good sheet mask. So over here, we grabbed this um, three pack of body wash. This was only $9 for three body washes. So I thought that was a really good deal. Me and the kids can use that one. I grabbed some pine saw for mopping. I don't know why I grabbed this. I think I just grabbed this because it was super cheap. It was like 30 cents and I'll probably just put this in like the half bathroom. 
And then over here, I grabbed some Lysol kitchen cleaner, some microband. This was on sale for like $2, I want to say. And then over here, we just grabbed some toilet paper. So that is everything, you guys. It's a lot of stuff to put away. But um, if you all enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video.